guys, in this video, I'll show you 10 quick fire team games that are perfect for adding some extra fun and energy to your classes. Let's take a look. One, two, three, four. Number one. Now this is a question answer game and all you need is a ball. Now preferably a ball that can bounce. So you can either use something like a football or go a bit crazy and bring in the yoga ball. So first of all ask your students to stand up in a circle and explain to them you will ask one student a question. Then you will bounce the ball towards the student, okay? But they have to answer the question correctly before catching the ball. So if they manage to answer correctly and catch the ball, this student can then carry on. So they can ask another student a question, bounce the ball, they have to answer and catch. Now if the student doesn't answer before catching the ball or answers incorrectly, they are out. Okay, so play the game until you have one student left standing. Game number two I call Find the Leader. So once again, have your student stand in a big circle and ask for one student to leave the classroom. Now, when they are outside the classroom, assign one student in the circle to be the leader and explain any movement they make, all the other students have to copy them, okay? So if the leader touches his nose, all the other students have to touch their nose. If the leader laughs, all the other students have to laugh. If he jumps, if he moves his hands, anything at all, the other students have to follow. I feel good. <laughs> So ask for the student that's outside the door to come back in and stand in the middle of the circle. Then the game begins. So the student in the middle has to find the leader, okay? Now this game can get hilarious. It's so funny. So I'm sure your students will love this one. Okay, so let's look at game number three. What's your favorite color? Blue. Why? I don't know. Why? Mm, I don't like science. Why? Maths is my favorite. Why? Because I like numbers. Why? No! God, please, no! 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 Okay, next game. I call 1 to 13. 13 equals ball. So, how to play? Have all of your students stand up and explain, the first student can say one to four numbers. For example, they can say one, or one, two, one, two, three, or one, two, three, four. The next student then can say five, or five, six. The next student, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, eleven. Next student, twelve. Next student, thirteen. Boom! So the student who says thirteen has to sit down. So move on to the next student and play the game around the whole class until you have one student that's left. Okay, on to the next game. <laughs> this game I call Try Not To Laugh and it's great fun to play in any of your classes. So simply have all your students stand up 
and explain if they smile or laugh, they have to sit down. You can ask them some questions. You can show some pictures, show a video, anything at all. If a student smiles or laughs, oh, sit down. So play the game until you have one student left standing. <laughs> So the next game I call make a story. So each student can add one word to the story. For example, the first student says the on the board, the. Next student, girl, okay, the girl. Went, went to the park and she blah 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 blah. It's up to you how long you make the game last. But generally, you can get some pretty funny stories created from this game. We have one extra bonus game for you today, and it's a memory game. I actually made a video a while ago on my channel, I'll put a link here somewhere. How to play the game, uh, you can ask the student a simple question. So for example, what do you like? The first kid says, I like bananas. The next student says, I like bananas and apples. The next student has to say, I like bananas, apples, and pineapples. <laughs> okay, I like apples, bananas, pineapples, and grapes. You keep playing the game until one student has forgotten. Okay guys, hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers. <laughs>